Since Monday, Indiana has been slowly reopening businesses for the first time since the COVID-19 pandemic left the state shuttered for more than a month. And I'm thrilled that our business have t businesses have taken that cautiously optimistic approach hmm. to trying to make sure that they're doing things right as opposed to just doing things quickly. On Wednesday, Green Tree Mall reopened its doors to customers with limited hours while the food court and common seating areas remained closed. Officials on both sides of the river praised each other for their cooperation and contributions to the metro economy. But when it comes to reopening now, those on this side have much more concerns. The data tells us it's just too soon uh, to go to restaurants and malls. The fewer people you're around, the less the chances are of the virus coming to you are you passing the virus to somebody else? Indiana has a larger population and a higher number of tests performed, but Louisville Metro officials say they're concerned about the higher number of positive cases Indiana has seen. They're allowing gatherings of 25 people or less, and quite frankly, that really scares me. But Indiana officials say their experience can be helpful to Kentucky as the state begins reopening next week. So as those businesses are getting guidance from the state, we can share best practices. We, they can look at what we're doing. Um, and our actions today are not going to show up in the data until two weeks from now. And so it's just hard to see even these small reopenings that we did last week. We won't know the effect of that for another week. So for now, Mayor Fisher encourages Kentuckians to only travel to Indiana for essential business. Drew Gardner, WLKY News.